In this video, you will learn how to set up a leveling system using Lurker Bot. First, make sure to add the Lurker Bot to your server. Now, let's create some level roles that will be rewarded to users. For this video, I will be creating six different level roles. Important, make sure to move the lurker bot role above all of the other roles so that it can function properly. Now, head over to the Lurkar website. Click the login button and log in through your Discord account. Next, click on the dashboard and choose your server. Go to the leveling tab and toggle the leveling system. Leveling channels. Here, you can choose which channels members cannot gain XP in. Think of it as a no XP channel, for example. I'll add the bot commands channel. Oh, and don't forget, toggle this option if you want members to gain XP in threads and forum posts. Leveling blacklists. Add the roles that won't gain any levels. For this example, I'll choose the muted role. All-time leaderboard champion. Now, this is something new, so let me explain. Here, you'll add the roles you want to assign to the hash1 user on the leaderboard. For instance, in this leaderboard example, I'm at the number one spot, so I'll get this role. The next day, if someone else claims the hash1 spot, they'll get the role instead. I already have a role, so I'll add it here. You can also add roles that won't be eligible for the champion role, like staff roles. That way, staff members won't be able to claim it. Level up message. Here you can decide where you want the level up message to appear. In the user's DMs, in the same channel, in a specific channel, or don't send the message at all. I'll choose the same channel option. Now, this is the default level up message. Want to see how it looks? Head to your server, run the command test, and choose the XP message option. Here's the default message. Let's customize it. Use a colon to access your server's custom emojis. Use curly brackets to insert different variables into the message. Let's make this message unique. If you want, you can copy the message template from the description. I'll also use it as an embed and tweak the embed color. At the bottom, you'll see an option that says, only send level up messages for levels with role rewards. Yes, of course. Now, let's see how the customized message looks. Let me know in the comments, do you like it? Role Rewards. Here, you will select the roles that you want to reward the users. For example, at level two, you'll choose the level two role. At level five, you'll pick the level five role, so on and so forth. What should happen to the previous rewards? Do you want to keep them or remove them? I'll stick with the default, keep previous rewards. Add any roles here that won't be rewarded, for example, the muted role. Automatically resetting levels. Whenever a user leaves the server or is banned, do you want their levels to be deleted? If yes, choose one of the given options, otherwise leave it unchecked. Server-wide default customizations. This section is all about the rank progress bar color. Click on the custom color option and pick a color you like. Web leaderboard. 
Here you can add a vanity URL for your server's leaderboard. Simply enter your server's name or something close to it. When you're done, scroll to the top and click Save Settings. Now, let's move to the Multipliers tab. Global Multipliers. Here, you can set how fast or slow users gain experience. I usually set this at 0 0.75. Sorry to interrupt, but if you're looking to set up a new server or else you want to upgrade your server, then make sure to check out my services. If you're interested, then make sure to fill in the form. It's the first link in the description. Finally, let's go back to the server. As you can see, I earned some XP by typing in the off-topic channel. LurkR has so many commands, it might overwhelm a normal user. Let's restrict them. Go to Server Settings, Integrations, and click on LurkR. If you want to restrict commands to certain roles, like the member role, select it here. If you want to limit commands to specific channels, like the bot commands channel, select that here. But users might still access all commands. So, disable the all channels option. Now you can go to specific commands and overwrite them by adding the channel. Now, if I test this with my alt account, I'll only see the commands that I've enabled. If you want to create beautiful embedded messages like this, then watch this video.